here, start using the spin, doing increased insane damage, having a critical hit damage again. And if you can see here now in this build, we're having a crazy amount of talent. Welcome to build number three for the beer school technique um, episodes or series, I would say. Um, We've been here <laughs> killing some enemies because um, they don't want to go away. So. So I'm just giving a short showcase already how this build is going. Uh, this time we're talking about a tank build. Um, this is again another episode of the overall top 5 beer school uh, builds. Uh, it is number, it's build number 3 after the metamorphosis build and this will connect to the first metamorphosis build as well. Um, let's see if I can still use some troll decoction so I don't get too much damage um, receive no where's the troll decoction decoction okay well can't use that so yeah that's the um, that's the metamorphosis tank build so there's two versions of it we can also have it with with actually euphoria uh, but we are focusing this time on metamorphosis because it is a bit different and it's also pr pretty overpowered I would say so I don't want to have every build with euphoria so I'm switching a bit off and these two are actually the most strongest uh, alchemies you can have um, and why I'm focusing this time on metamorphosis is because of alchemy so for example I can use all of the alchemy things here to make this build stronger but first of all, nothing really changes. We're using this two zones, Knight Steel Sword, um, with the increased damage, similar to the Severance, increase the range of will, but we're using the SF, not the Arendite, as I said in another video, is because of the critical hit damage bonus we will get. Then, this time at the Urzen Armor, I'm focusing on heavy armor, so I excluded the levity and Included retribution gives a 30% chance of returning a portion of the damage received to the attacker because there's another option we can choose, which is anyway better than that. Uh, yeah, so uh, we also using again the guardman's gauntlet because the critical hit damage bonus because this one will focus on a tank and actually strong attacks. So we can actually either be doing the wheel stuff um, or the, the tank build. Which is, but I think we leave it like that so we have more variety. I'm a big fan of the wheel in general, just in case if you have a stronger enemy and the strong attacks is kind of slow. Um, yeah, so here we're having resistance to elemental damage. Um, just to have even more tanks so we don't focus this time on Quen. Um, using again the similar decoction as in literally every other build. Um, so we can still vary super super Tony O. Um, but another option would be we could also use, for example, the Vitality Regeneration. So we don't really need the Troll Decoction to boost ourselves up. Yeah, but the thing is we anyways do so much damage, I don't really mind about that. Um, similar to the other builds, we're using the strong attacks and the uh, fast attacks. So we have more variety using a similar always resolve and Razor Focus and this time it doesn't really change much to the Metamorphosis build um, so we have to protect coding um, when consumer can we have a higher increase in vitality which is the main focus on hello everyone and a short notice um, I started a discord channel uh, the link is down below where you can enter uh, my community in, in discord where I will be showcasing a couple of builds you can also have the opportunities like, hey, uh, Jeff, have you tried this build? Um, so you can also recommend me builds I can uh, include into my top five or in general explain the builds, what makes them strong, what makes them special. So if you're interested in that, the link is down below. You can also have the opportunity to like showcase your own builds. So for example, if you would like to like, hey, I have a really, really nice build, which is really strong in The Witcher 3, um, you can put it into the Discord, we can have a um, conversation about it, we can also chat about it, it's like 
okay, how can we make this build stronger? Is it fun to play? And, or maybe I can include it in the next build and all your builds can be part of the top five builds. And then I will link, for example, your account included into um, the next build. So if you're interested in that, follow the link down below and see you guys in the Discord channel. Bye. This one, because it's a tank build, we're focusing more on vitality and just taking every damage we can and focusing on critical hit and getting more potions out of it. In my case, it's one of the strongest and this time what has changed to the other builds also is we're using this time the beer school techniques. Um, so p uh, um, each piece of heavy armor increases maximum vitality by 5% um, and strong attack. Yeah, there would be one thing which I actually forgot. So we couldn't have, oh yeah, it is anyways heavy armor, so we don't need it. Perfect, perfect. Um, and we're using metamorphosis. There's another version with the euphoria, but we're focusing on metamorphosis. And yeah, let's check it out how strong this build is. So we're spawning our enemies again. So for example, if I'm doing the wheel, as here, I'm, I'm fueling up, I would say, my metamorphosis. So I'm getting all the critical hits. Um, boosting up the damage, having our vitality at 15,000, um, silver sword also pretty high, um, and the difference here with Ekimaru decoction, water hack, night ride, doppler decoction. So it really depends what you actually get out of it. Yep, oh, yep, oh, yep. So here, earth elemental, and what we also do in this one. Getting some boost in other stuff, so we have a higher toxicity and our vitality is at 17,000 against for strong damage. And we have still a really long way. And here again, getting just a crazy amount of damage again. And the thing is, the interesting thing is now, let's check it out. We go, for example, here using the super hang decoction uh, potion we just kind of get rid of we're just getting rid of the echidnas because they're just super annoying Okay, didn't really got... Okay, so... Focus on here. Still, ha yeah, and you see, as you can see here, the vitality goes higher and higher. Um, the longer we are in the fight. Okay, I don't know why we're not doing any damage right now. What is happening? Okay, that's kind of weird. Oh, it was the wrong sword. Okay, now I get it. Okay, so we use accidentally the wrong sword for the damage. That's the reason. Yeah. Let's kill the last one here. Oh, I hope it just doesn't affect anything. So we spawn again the same amount. We are having three um, alchemies. And let's crush it a bit. Doing the spin. Getting our criticals, also getting some other damage, and as you can see here now, yeah, with protecting coating on, and I don't really take any damage, so that's a tank build. I don't focus on Quen actually, so we don't really hit any damage that much. And now, getting back to it, getting our damage back, so super easy, super strong build, yeah. And not Euphoria, so that makes it a bit interesting, I would say, than the other ones. So, yeah. 
focusing on that. Um, another thing what we can also focus on this time here. So we're getting here, we're having probably pretty high damage again. Yeah, vitality is pretty high. And the in one of the most interesting things I would say on this build is we have a pretty pretty long range. Let's what I really don't like in general. Um, well, I mean, if you want to fight stronger enemies with a higher damage, we're spawning one troll. And let's see. Oh, wrong sword. And getting him one damage and. 15,000 and again so it's pretty easy with a strong attack to kill enemy so if you're having stronger um, enemy and it's just one fight just you can just do the strong attacks and it just crushes everything so yeah that was the metamorphosis build um, it, it's my favorite one there's a lot of different options we can change actually um, so we can change the vitality, for example. We can also change to Quinn, or we can also change to Euphoria, which is another option of this build. But yeah, this time we stick a metamorphosis, so the top five is not only focusing on Euphoria. So we also have other options to play. Yeah. Thanks very much for watching this video, and see you guys in the next uh, long format build guide.